In this specific video, you're going to learn how to install WTouch, which is a specific plugin, and make your site mobile friendly. Now, this day and age, as technology advances with mobile phones and smartphones, you need to keep up to date with the technology. So keep in mind that a lot of people are viewing your site with their smartphones with their iPhone, with their Android, and so forth. So you want to make it so it's user-friendly to mobile users as well as regular PC and Macintosh users. So that's what we're going to make sure that your site is mobile-friendly in this specific video. So let's go over to the plugins section and we're going to click on Add New. And we're looking for the WP Touch plugin. So type that in here, click on search plugins. And make sure that the WP Touch is one word. So at WP Touch as one word. And this is the plugin that we want. So go ahead and install this plugin. And now that it is installed, if we go under settings and click on WP Touch, we can configure the settings here. So I'm going to walk you through step by step through the configuration settings. You can have WP Touch automatically detect the language. So I'm going to leave that as it is. And it says home page redirection. And you can set the home page as to where you want mobile users to see first. So you can s specify a specific page. And it can be a different page than what the regular PC users see. So what we're doing here is we are customizing the experience for a mobile user. And you can change the site title text. We can call this funny t-shirts mobile version. And if you want to create the experience whereas mobile users see certain categories but they don't see other categories, you can do that as well by including the category IDs right here. And it says text justify options this actually relates to this and this is just the alignment of the text and we're gonna leave that as it is and post listing options you can choose between calendar icons post thumbnails and so forth and I'm gonna leave all of this default and you can also change the footer message here. We've got advanced options. You can allow zooming on content. So if somebody has a small smartphone, they can zoom in on the content. You can enable categories tab in the header. You can enable tabs tab in the header you can enable a search link in the header. So the point of this is really just making everything as user friendly as possible for the mobile reader and the viewers that come to your site. And you can also set it where the mobile users will see the desktop theme, which is in this case your actual WordPress theme. Not to be confused that WP Touch is a plugin and it's somewhat of a theme but it's it's a theme for mobile users so if you check this mobile users will see the desktop theme first now you probably want to do it the other way around where they see the WP touch theme first and then if they want to see the desktop theme they can get out of that and that's usually how it is you can have push notification options 
which this integrates into a site called Prowl, and you can read more about that. That is not needed. You can change the style and the color options here. We're going to leave it as is. And you can add Google AdSense to the site and everything like that. We're just going to leave that blank. And you can also add stats and a custom code. So for example, if you wanted to keep track of how many mobile users you have, you know, the statistics and things like that, you can actually enter the Google Analytics code right here. However, keep in mind that even if you don't include the Google Analytics code here, if you have Google Analytics on your main site, it can actually detect mobile users if you have that option set within your Google Analytics account. And then of course in this section is the bookmark icons. And then you have your logo icons, your menu item and page icons. And we're going to leave that the same. And that's it. So click on save options when you're done. And now every time you visit the site with a mobile or smartphone, you'll be able to see a user friendly WTouch theme for that mobile phone.